Giants defensive end Jason Pierre-Paul says even though the Eagles are 4-1, and one, they could be 0-4. Oh Jason, 4 plus 1 is 5, not 4. But who's counting? Now, in the last two weeks, the Eagles have two offensive touchdowns and seven turnovers. Meantime, this season, they've scored seven non-offensive touchdowns, which begs the question, are the Eagles lucky or good? A question tight end Brent Selleck doesn't want to hear from anyone. You guys are the ones that are determining whether you know we're not playing well enough or we are. I mean, I don't know. We're winning football games. Do we have to improve? We do, definitely. And I think that's going to be the story throughout the entire year is that we can always get better. There's things that we can always do. We can always fix things. Uh, but, you know, we're 4 and one Wait till you hear what Darwin Walker has to say on Game Day Live Sunday at 11 a.m. Then it's Fox NFL Sunday at noon. Dolphins and Packers at 1 o'clock. At 425, Cowboys see if they can go the distance with the champs. A busy day of football on Fox 29. Two games down for the Flyers, two men down for the Flyers. Their two top defensemen, Kimo Timonen battling blood clots, and Braden Coburn, who the team says will be out for a while. On top of those losses, the Flyers have two losses. Tomorrow night against Montreal, they'll try to avoid an 0-3 start. Remember, it's a long season, 80 games left, and the Flyers say they will not panic. You play games and you you win two or you lose two. You have team meetings and you want to get better. You know, uh, you lose two in a row. You don't want to get too low. You know, you and if you win two in a row, you can can't get too high. You know, basically those are things that the players on this team know. It's one thing to to know and and then to see it uh, makes things a little bit clearer. And we have an opportunity tomorrow night to be better. The Sixers play in their third preseason game. No Nerlens Noel. He has an injured thigh, and the team decided to hold him out tonight. The longest tenured Sixer who was traded in the offseason, Thaddeus Young and his new team, the Wolves, hosting the Sixers. Number one overall pick, Andrew Wiggins, knows about being traded. From Cleveland, never got a chance to play with LeBron, but he can do that. And uh, Tony Roten, he says, anything you can do, I can do better. Yep. But the Sixers lose 116 to 110. Now, I'm glad this story is coming up with Scott and Ian. A boxing lesson to anyone who takes up the sport. You got to protect your face, but you got to protect your body. Talk oh, about a low oh. blow. Yeah, bam. Oh, oh. Whoop, there it is. <laughs> now, <laughs> now, this dude stays on the campus for five minutes. Adding insult to injury, it's ruled a TKO because he can't continue. By the way, I was online all night. You can get a cup online for $7.99. <laughs> it doesn't cost it a lot. Not that much. <laughs> you gotta, gotta protect yourself. eBay, whatever. Right, right. you know what? Uh, investment. Yeah, it is an investment. It is. A crucial one. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. That's a tough fight. Uh, and then he gets a TKO, he's out of there. Yeah, he loses on top right. of that. You know? Yeah. That, that's tough. <laughs> <laughs> that's tough. All right. Uh, all right, what's our weather looking like?